So what you gonna be, sugar? Are you gonna stand by me or kneel before me? Alchemist. Alchemist is dead. I'm sorry to hear that. I liked her a lot more than you. Think of it, Ted. Together, we can rule the universe. Together, we could... You know, Entropy, you do have one thing in common with Alchemist. Yes, and what's that? You both don't know how to take no for an answer. Pretty witty for a walking teapot. Now let's see what else you've got in that suit. As his former friend's strength grows, Manbot realizes the terrible truth of the perilous power of entropy. Her very existence tears at the fabric of reality. And as reality breaks down, the people and places of planet Earth begin to disappear. Worse, they never existed at all. Manbop, listen carefully. I cannot maintain my mental presence in this timeline for long. Where are you? Reality has nearly completely dissipated. It is only through the use of all my powers that I've managed to maintain a handful of your comrades in that reality. They are on their way to join you. And you? I no longer exist in your reality. I can maintain this mental projection only with the greatest of effort. So, all hope is lost. Ceasing to exist has freed me from certain preconceptions I was bound to in my physical form. Entropy is capable of wielding unimaginable power, but even she has her limits. But there is one who is more powerful, one who has no limits. Who are you? This is no time for humility, man, but you have never tapped the limits of energy X that dwell within your metallic prison. You must free yourself of all restraint. You must allow yourself to realize your potential, for it is that potential alone that can stop entropy. But how? You must confront entropy and channel everything within you directly at her at point-blank range. If my calculations are correct, the blast will weaken her, enabling you to meet her in a fair fight. The distraction will also allow me to instantiate several team members to help you destroy entropy. Destroy her? But this is no time for sentimentality, Manbot. Alchemist has ceased to exist. The universe is about to share her fate. There is something else. If entropy is destroyed and the world restored, you will return to the celestial clock. Yes, I understand. If only there was another way. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Must remove all barriers. <laughs> So silence reigned. Welcome back, good viewer. This is the Sky Rider, and this, my friends, is the finale. This is the last episode of Freedom Force vs. the Third Reich, and we will begin it with a very quick training. Uh, because at this point, the training for most of these heroes is largely academic. Uh, a few are relevant because they will be the ones that we will be using in this episode. Uh, Man of War is one that we will be using, I can tell you that now. Um, let's see, we want Electrical Arc, we want Storm Bolt, and Bermuda Triangle, funnily enough. Microwave, uh, we'll just get Meltdown for him. Minuteman. Uh, Put the points into there. Uh, the ant. Whoops. Uh, well, let's buy nimble and upgrade other things. Because sadly, we're not using the ant for this one. Field punch for Sky King. 
Uh, in fact, all of these characters are largely irrelevant now because we're not really using them, so... There's padding the video for you. Interesting cutscene, that. Uh, I do like Manbot's response to Entropy. You do have one thing in common with Alchemists. You both don't know how to take no for an answer. <laughs> That's a good line. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, good viewer. This, for some reason, this cough just refuses to go away. Like, I've been fine for, like, about a week. Or, or not, for, like, I, I had this illness, like, over a week ago now. And yet this cough is still persistent. It's, it's just niggling, you know what I mean? It's just, it just, it's, 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 a, it's an incredibly low health, but it refuses to die, so to speak. But yes very, uh, it is a very bleak view that we have, with en with uh, reality collapsing around us like it does. And the ruins here of the Freedom Fortress and Manbot standing alone. And of course, those uh, shadows that you see at the end there, which are meant to be the three extra team members, who, I'm pretty sure that if you look at those team members, none of them look like any sort of team member of Freedom Force, which I thought was quite funny. Still, generic shadows are generic. And now for the shortest mission briefing of all time, good viewer. She's down. This is our only chance, team, for freedom. Not only that, but the most redundant briefing of all time. Since we know what we must now do. So, good viewer, for this final mission, we must take along Manvot, which is good, he'll be useful. And we will also take the Green Genie, Man of War and Tombstone. And without any further ado, good viewer, because I want to get this all done in this one episode, let's enter the fray. She's down! This is our only chance, team, for freedom! That's what I mean about it being redundant, good viewer. You'll notice, good viewer, that uh, things are very quiet. You can only hear the winds in the background, no music. It's quite, it's very eerie, I must say, they, they do do that very well. Okay. Ooh. Oh! Wow. Wow, Manbot. Manbot damaged. <laughs> that, that was beautiful. <laughs> oh, that's a, that's a good omen, good viewer. I'm going to take play. that as a, as a good thing. This should perk you up. And you can see here that Manbot uh, has opened up his suit. And is making full use of his uh, of his powers. Uh, this should perk you up. Now, oh, excellent, good viewer. I am feeling very confident about this. That is a very good sign because normally, uh, Genie's speed boost is very bad with Manbot because he absorbs energy attacks, and that works both ways. There she is, good viewer. Oh, Entropy. To play with. Time to fly? And I must say, good viewer. But there's a very specific trick to dealing with these rates. Blow Manbot up. Oh wow. <laughs> uh, yeah, basically give you a um thoughtless woman. We'll teach her the error of her ways for this day is out. Reality itself is starting to disintegrate. At the same time. The chaos of the collapse is strengthening her. Wow, good viewer. This is going. This is going absurdly well. No one's taken any. Well, actually, Manbot's taken a bit of damage, but yes. huh, and it appears that his weakness and resistance bar is bugging out. Ready. You see, in fact, play. it seems that most. Oh no, not everyone's, but Manbot's. Manbot's bugged out a bit, but oh well. Uh, yes, the, what you're meant to do, good viewer, is you're meant to sort of proceed from bit to bit as the buildings begin to collapse, to play with. and reality itself uh, proceeds to be, to degenerate even further. You you fight Entropy and her minions, and then once you've done X amount of damage, she'll teleport to the next location. And of course, as before, she will, um, she will, her weaknesses and resistances will switch. Okay. But this good viewer is getting a bit silly. Because this is getting... Uh, the damage here is getting rather absurd. Oh dear, that's not good. Quick, object lesson, Genie. 
Um, yeah, normally I've taken a lot more damage by this stage. I'm rather impressed. Uh, if I do see so myself. Oh, no, hang on. Object lesson. Let's power it up to be sure. Storm bolt and... Well, let's just uh, let's just try and get rid of these things, shall we? Yes, excellent genie. Okay. Uh oh. Get rid of it. Man of war. Good. Good. Okay. Take out the th the other chaos wraith, uh, and that will stop the subterrestrials from creating nasty beast disease. Almost. Got them. Okay. Excellent. Okay. Everyone, back off. Now we need to deal with the subterrestrials. And it appears that Dave is bugging out. Good viewer, this is this is absurd. Everything is going far too well. Uh, normally this this last um, mission is normally at least a bit tricky. Uh, okay, but entropy is putting everybody in stasis, so everybody back off. Well, who is, Matt? You're definitely not known for your patience, but Man of War, but there's nothing you can do at the moment. Okay. The one disadvantage of bringing along Tombstone on the Gushin Good Viewer is that he does have a lot of health, but he's also weak to all of the attacks that the enemies bring along. Uh, so, you need to be careful about that. But, Good Viewer, we have found a use, at long last, for Bermuda Triangle. Because, of course, these bastards are vulnerable to mystical attacks, which Bermuda Triangle is. <laughs> so we actually have a use for it. I... And, uh, of course, Tombstone is very good for doing damage, so he can take out the subterrestrials if you stun them like that. And that leaves us to focus on Entropy herself. Basically, you'll, you'll basically switch between... Ooh, crap. I forgot about that guy. <laughs> uh, let's take him out first. Manbot, you focus on dueling your beloved. Your former beloved. Give it another dead reckoning tombstone. Beautiful! Okay, uh, yeah, Manbot, you focus on blasting her. That is one slight disadvantage of this team, is that uh, basically she'll switch between being weak to electricity and weak to energy, which are your two main uh, attacks here, really good viewer. Uh, particularly because everything in this mission is weak to that, that's basically what you want to bring along. So, ooh, she's stunned, that's good, and it's basically just a case of, um, of, uh, of, what is it basically a case of? Yeah, of switching between electricity and energy, good viewer. <laughs> that's, uh, that's essentially what it is. Okay, let's give it a powered up focus. You do you do need to be careful. Stay away from me. I'm warning you. She's weakening. Keep pressing freedom force. Ah oh, no, there it goes. I knew it was too good to last. Um you do need to be careful, uh, good viewer, of uh, of how you're attacking entropy, because you could be trying to throw multiple Time attacks at her at once. So that you could be, say, trying to throw an electrical attack at her. Everyone else back off a bit. Uh, but then someone else will hit her with another attack, and they'll sudden, she'll suddenly be resistant to it, to electricity. Okay, man, boss. Blow him up. Oh, double KO! Oh, good viewer. Release. It's so useful in this mission, it really is. Uh, <laughs> I'm surprised at how effective it is, I must say. Uh, okay. Bermuda Triangle, that's subterrestrial, if you would. Beautiful. Okay, Dead Reckoning, please. Tombstone. One shot. Okay. Let's all back off here. Oh, and of course, with, um, with what do you call it? Uh, uh, chaotic Deflection Good Viewer, uh, Genie can prove a very good defensive uh, unit for a change. Manbot's in stasis. Okay, Man of War. Let's... Oh, Genie's in stasis. The Subterrestrial's in stasis. Day's in stasis. Everyone's in stasis. Oh, not quite. Okay, Manbot. Start dueling entropy. That That is a bit of a problem. There's a lot of electrical attacks in these heroes, not very many energy attacks, so... And when the one energy attack you do have is from Manbot, it's not vastly accurate. Let's try that again. Bermuda Triangle. 
Oh, that's not good. I'm going into action. Okay, um, let's just try it again. I am played by villains. Oh, you dare oppose me. Yes, HP, yes, I do. Funny, funnily enough, I tend to object to reality being destroyed. Back off, Genie. We do not want you getting hit. Tombstone. Yeah, Dead Reckoning Entropy. Dead Reckoning Entropy? Dead Reckon Entropy? Dead Reck... I, I don't know. Hitter. Tombstone. Just Hitter. Oh dear. That's not good. Okay. Let's try this. Power Devour. Tombstone, sir. Let's give this Dave an electrical arc. Again, down he goes. Okay. To, to be honest with you, I'm making this machine look a lot simpler than it is. It should not be going this easily. Okay, come on, hit her. And you want to know why I love this mission, good viewer? Look where we are. We've come full circle, good viewer. Talk about foreshadowing. That is what I love about this game. Like, I just... I love the foreshadowing. This entire sequence is foreshadowed right at the very beginning. When Alchemist comes out of the park, she fights Diablo here, she fights Minuteman on this roof and Liberty Lad down here, she rescues Manbot and Manbot turns against her. It's all, it's all a prophetic dream. And it all comes for full circle. There's so much foreshadowing with it. And it's just it's just brilliant. Okay. Let's move in. Hang on. Wait a minute. Where's Manbot? There he is. Okay. If you would stop moving quite so slowly, Let's sir. Play. Speed you up with my flying and... No. I, I really don't know this why it does this, good viewer. It's yes. just... It's one of those things where... Like, well, you have an X percent chance to, to cast this buff successfully, but it's on an ally. There is literally no disadvantage to being sped up like that. Uh-oh. That's not good, good viewer. That is a devastation race. We have not seen the last of those bastards, it seems, so let's focus him down. Before he uh, blows everything up. Back off, Tombstone. Electrical Arc, yes. Ooh, ouch. Oh dear, okay. Quick, heal yourself up if you can. Oh shit. Quick. Genie, get over here if you can. No, come on. Genie, where are you? We need you. Yes, okay. We don't need you. Well done, uh, Manbot. You actually hit things for once. That is much appreciated. Okay, Stormbolt. Focus. Static Zap. Spectre Shots. Just needed the one, excellent. Oh, and there's a Subterrestrial. Let's give him the old 1 2 combo. Bermuda Triangle. Oh dear, trust Bermuda Triangle to screw up right when I need it. There we go. Dead Reckoning Tombstone. Time to pay. Beautiful. Okay, let's go again. Right, let's start let's blasting him, why not? Your time grows short. Almost. Almost. Down he goes. That's all, good viewer. Now we just have Entropy herself. For some reason, it's taken to destroying buildings. Whatever will we do without the valuable prestige, good viewer? I honestly do not know. Is real but your pain. Ooh, wow, we actually got a yellow bubble out of Entropy Good Viewer. Normally, it's uh, it's always... Um, normally, it's always... Uh, what do you call it? What's the word? Normally, it's always grey. Okay, hang on. She's there. Okay, right, Tombstone, get in there. Dead Reckoning. Quickly, before the stun wears off. 54 damage, I'll take it. Finish her tombstone. Oh, almost. Almost, come on, finish her off. She may be resistant to energy, but we can still take her. Almost, come on, guys. Oh, tombstone back off. There she goes, blasted in the face by her beloved. Well, good viewer. 
That's it. We've just beaten the game. All that's left to do is interrogate entropy. How hard could it be? Manbot, do the honors. It's impossible. My powers fading. How? You may be more powerful than Alchemist, but she had something you don't. Friends. Friends who could have told her that no power is limitless. You never held back, and now you're drained. And now, if I release a full burst of Energy X while you are in your weakened state, perhaps even you could be stopped. Could you fools not see what you've done? You've cleansed the world of all those who could dare challenge me. And now, nothing stands between Time Master and his revenge. Death to Freedom Force! Keep him away from entropy. If he reabsorbs her power, we'll never be able to defeat him. I'll feed some of my Energy X into the rest of you to give us a better chance. You really didn't think it was going to be that easy, did you, good viewer? Welcome, good viewer, to once again, the final boss. Time Master himself. This is, of course, one reason why we bring Genie along, because Let's she has the ability fun. to speed the, everybody up. Which means that we can get to the other end of the map, because, of course, that's where Time Master spawns. Of course, Time Master isn't really that fast, so you do have to stop him from getting to the park and getting to Entropy, command. but that's not really that difficult. This perk you up. But admittedly, it is why we bring Genie along. Okay, keep flying, Antbot, and let's keep trying speeding frenzy. I, uh, I really don't understand why they make it that way for allied Time attacks. It literally makes no sense. This perk you up. I mean, it gives a, it gives, does give a disadvantage, but I. To, to the player, but I, I don't know, it just seems like a weird choice. Oh well. Yes, fortunately Time Master stomps along very slowly there in all his pinky yellowy glory. Manbot, do the honours, would you? Let's open with a release. Everybody else back off a bit. Oh dear, that wasn't good. Okay, let's try this again. Uh, wonder if Bermuda Triangle will work. No, it won't. Okay, shooting Tombstone. Okay, Tombstone, back off. Everybody blast him. I must say, good viewer, that Time Master is not really that complicated. It's literally just a case of blasting him. Just nuke him down. Because he's weak to it. You have all the weak, all the attacks that you need uh, to defeat him. Oh, back off, Manbot, back off. We do not want you to get hit by Man of War. Oh dear. Oh, in fact, Manbot, you need to back off because if you die. Back off in the space time rift. Okay, keep him stunned, Genie. Dead Reckoning Tombstone. Yeah, that's not good. Okay, heal yourself up. I do love. I do love Time Master's speech, I must say. Oh, that's beautiful, almost. Okay, back off. Keep blasting him, Genie. Everybody, gather together. 19 HP, and we win. Like that. We've got to keep Time Master away from entropy. Time Master is even more powerful to put the temporal shackles on him, so he'll be unable to time travel away. Are your minds so flaccid you can only think in three small dimensions? One who bends the power of entropy at will can exist at all points in time. While I lie prone and weak in this moment, I am simultaneously at the peak of my abilities as I was before you meddled in my affairs. Must get up, can't let time master... By drawing upon Entropy's power, I command not only the fourth dimension of time, but the fifth dimension of the countless alternate realities. And I can make you suffer in all of its infinite possibilities. With her as my vassal, I am unstoppable. Hey, Time Slime. Hands off the metal man. He's taken. Why, look at you. 
all this time, and I never knew how damn handsome you were. What? But I thought you were... Insane? Mad with power? Hmm. I am. I can feel entropy trying to come back fighting against me. But seeing Time Master hurt you like that brought something. Brought the real alchemist, the real me, back. But I can't stay. Entropy's coming. You can fight her. No, I can't. And you can't fight her and Time Master together. So there's only one thing for a girl who can control the very nature of existence to do. What? Alchemist. Catherine, you, you can't. And that's to make it so I never did exist. No. Stop it. Well, I can. Foolish girl. Oh. But don't worry. You won't be able to miss me. Because I never will have been here. No. 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 Madre de Dios, what's going on here? The reality stream has been restored. We've been brought back to our own dimension, along with the rest of Earth. Mentor. Time Master. My cortical suppression power will hold the fiend at bay until we can get him into the temporal tank at the Freedom Fortress. What did you do to stop Time Master? I... I... I don't know. It's as if something incredible happened. As if somebody saved us. But I can't recall who. At least we're all safe, and everything's back to normal. Right. After seeing how things work in the 1960s, me and me mates are ripe ready to go back to World War II for a little peace and quiet. We are safe indeed. But I cannot help but think that all is not as it seems. It is as if the puzzle of the world has been put back in place, yet a vital piece is somehow missing. Oh. Where... where am I? I thought I was... thought I was... Hey, where am I? Come on, Stretch, start making with the answers. Of all those granted the gift, you alone have surprised me. The gift of what? Oh, you mean superpowers? Indeed. How predictable your kind has proven to be. The evil use the power for evil, and the good for good. But you, you are something different indeed. You didn't break the rules, you changed the rules. Enough about me. Mind telling me who you are? Me? I thought that would be obvious to one such as you. My dear girl, I am Energy X. Come again? What? What? What the actual fu- Oh, here we are once again, good viewer, with the epic music. This is this is beautiful. As I've said before, at the end of the last game, I love this music. And that's it, good viewer. That is the end of Freedom Force vs. the Third Reich and the end of the Freedom Force series. Left on such a cliffhanger, and I wish they'd do another one, because, I mean, you can tell by that ending. Surely you can tell they plan to do another one, because that just screams, you know, cliffhanger and sequel to me. Oh dear, brilliant. I, I love this game. I love that that end there where where Alchemist comes back briefly uh, and she sees Manbot for the first time and then just erases herself from existence. And Mentor's last line, you know, I feel as the puzzle of the world has been put back in place, but a vital piece is still missing. Like that's that's quite tragic, really. And and speaking of epic music, good viewer of this epic music, those violins. Like, I just love the fact that they foreshadowed the violins right from the beginning. I mean, foreshadowing is nothing new, but I just love the fact that they did that. It's just, I just love the way that was constructed. It's brilliant. And, uh, yeah, and like seeing, like, Alchemist saying she can't stay and those violins playing and the entropy flashing up on her face. Like, that's, that's very eerie. I really like the way they did that. But yes, yeah, so that is the end of Freedom Force vs. the Third Reich, good viewer. Uh, it's strange, thinking that I've done the whole series that, because I started Freedom Force as the very first LP on my channel, and now I've done its sequel, and like, 
Uh, I know a lot of my subscribers came from, that I have at the moment, came from Freedom Force, so I hope that you will stay and, uh, uh, and, uh, view my future content, good viewer, because I've got my next LP planned, I think it's one you'll enjoy. Um, so please keep doing all the good stuff that you do, your likes, your comments, your subscriptions, all the things that all YouTubers ask you all the time to do, and I'm sure you're sick of it by now, but it really does help us out, so please continue to do that. So I will leave you with that image of Blitzkrieg, good viewer, and I will bid you farewell. So ladies and gentlemen, this has been the Skyrider, and until next time, farewell, until we meet again.